Well, the 70th anniversary is a really important moment to celebrate everything the NHS has achieved, everything the NHS does, um, but also to prepare the ground for where the NHS has to go uh, over the next three years. And there are three areas that I think patients will see more from the digital solutions that we're building. One is more access digitally with our NHS 111 online platform, with some of the apps and wearables that are coming through, with the ability to uh, access apps in a more simplified way. So you can ac expect to access the NHS in its broader context better than we can now. Uh, secondly, easier to transact with the NHS. So we have e-prescribing, we have e-bookings, uh, we have different ways of completing a transaction electronically, but there will be more as we bring different uh, channels and platforms on stream that will make it easier to complete a transaction within our digital channels. Um, and thirdly, uh, it will be easier for the NHS to recognize you as an individual. So that isn't just through all we're trying to do in terms of an integrated care record, but also your identity and how we verify your identity to make it easier for you to be recognized by the NHS as an individual. Um, so those three ways, I think, are important dimensions to the delivery of the five-year forward view and the delivery of the technology components to it. And it will be, you know, a lot of these things are reaching a tipping point where we're building the infrastructure, we're getting the ecosystem to come together, we're asking different partners to deliver according to certain standards and requirements. Uh, we're asking the system to converge on standard tech terminology and taxonomy for how we code things. Um, so I'm really very optimistic that the money we've been given to spend, uh, which is 4.2 billion up to 2023, I'm really optimistic that patients will see uh, much more progress in those three areas as we go into our 70th anniversary.